hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding how to show two different values in a many to one field in Odoo. so currently in the screen you are seeing Odoo version 14 community edition and this method can be applicable across all the Odoo versions so currently in the screen i have already installed the om hospital module in this database and we have a patient field here so on clicking the patient field you can see the list of the patients is getting listed like a reference and its name so this is a many to one field that shows list of patients so what we will be doing is that i will be adding one more field patient with same many to one and i will be showing the patient names without the code without hp005 that is in patient first patient field we will have code and name and in the second minute one field we will have only name so let's see how we can do that so i'll go to the pie charm and here this is my custom add-ons path and here we have the oim hospital module so we have to go to the corresponding model that is hospital dot appointment so i'll go to the models and we have appointment dot py here so here we can see we have patient field patient id so simply i'll copy that and i will put it below just i'm creating a new field i'll just rename the technical name as patient name id just i'm putting like that to understand patient name and you can see fields dot mini to one and i have set the core model as hospital.patient and i'll put the string as patient name that's done now i'll copy this field and i will add it inside the view so appointment view.xml i'll control d i'll duplicate this and i have added the field in the view so what i have done is i have added a new field with core model as hospital.patient and i have added it inside the view also now so now we will just restart the service so you can see i have restarted the service now i'll go to the ui and i will upgrade the oin hospital module so from the apps i'll just upgrade the odo 14 development tutorials that is oim hospital module so you can see the module has been uh, successfully upgraded now if you come back to the hospital then to the appointments and if you try to click on create you can see you have two fields patient and patient name so you can see here you can see hp005 alex and same value is coming here so right now both fields are many to one and are referring to same core model that is hospital.patient and now what we will be seeing how we can show only name here and here we have to show code and name so first of all the value is coming from the name get method we have already made the video so if you go to the code and if you go to the appointment.py file and if you scroll down you can see we have a function called name get sorry in patient so if you go to the patient you can see the core model has having a name get function defined so if i comment this so what i have done is i have just commented this and if i restart the service and if i come to the ui you can see only name is getting listed so initially the name and code is coming from this name get function so i'll just add the video description in the description section about the video link of the name get function so you just need to understand that the name get function is responsible for value coming like code and name so if i remove the comment and if i come back here you can see code and name is coming so that's done now we have to separate we have to show only name here for that what we have to do we have to set a context so right now if i print here so i'll just add a print statement here i'll just put a context and if i print self.env 
dot context so simply i have added a context just printing a context self.env context just restart the service and if you come to the ui and if you click on here the name get function will be getting triggered you can see it get printed here inside context we have language time zone your id etc we have this information now now what i will do i'll go to the xml side and here i have to show only name so what i'll do i'll add an extra information to the context so i have just added a context key and the format should be dictionary hide code i'll simply add a context here that is i just add in context hide code true simply context equal to hide code equal to true here and i'll just restart the service and as it is a change in xml file you have to upgrade the module so i'll just upgrade the odoo 14 development tutorials module so you can see the module has been upgraded now what i'll do i'll go to the settings and i'll just activate the debug mode i'll come back to hospital then to appointments create appointment and if you place the mouse over here you can see in the pop-up hide code equal to true in the context and if i click on here and if you go to pycharm and in the con this in the log section you can see hide code true is come when when we click on second field hide code true will come and what if i click on the first field the name get will be triggered and in the context it will not be there because first field we doesn't add any context we have added context only for the second field so on clicking the first field context is context doesn't contain hide code and if i click on the second field you can check the context it contains hide code so based on this context hide code we will make some modification inside the name get method so what i'll do if i'll add an if condition if not if not self dot env on text dot get so i'll check in the context whether there is a key called hide code so it will execute only if there is no hide code i'll just explain else i will add like this so what i have done is that i have just modified the name get method and first i'll check whether there is a hide code inside context if not if there is not hide context hide code in the context we will add reference and name else we will show only name so we will see the change now so we have done the necessary things and if i go to the odoo and if i click on first field here we will see code plus name but right now when we click on here you can see it will show only name whereas it shows code plus name and in second field it will show only name that is because here we are checking the context this will get executed when there is no hide code in the context if there is hide code in the context it will come here and it will show only name so using context you can show different values in a many to one field so you can alter the context as you like or if i put here show code so if i put instead of hide code you can add show code true and using that you can show code if show code will be shown doing this else this so let's modify and see so instead of hide code i just changed to show code and removed from the second field and if i go to the ui and let me upgrade the odoo 14 development tutorials module and this solution is applicable across all the odoo versions all 15 or 14 13 12 10 11 every version it will be working now if i come to hospital then to create appointments first field will show this 
and second field name because normally name get function will return only the name if there is show code it appends the code so i hope you understood this video if you have any doubts suggestions or feel feedbacks don't hesitate to reach us over the email that is odomates at gmail.com and feel free to connect us in the social medias like linkedin facebook twitter instagram etc so that's it for the day have a nice day thank you